Okay, what's up everyone? So today mm-hmm. we're watching a very highly anticipated episode of Uncle Roger goes on a Zoom date with Auntie, Auntie Jenny. So, let's go. Hello niece and nephew, it's Uncle Roger. Today is big important day. Because today, Uncle Roger gonna go on Zoom date with Auntie Jenny. Oh, so exciting! This is Uncle Roger's first date since cold-hearted ex-wife Auntie Helen left. Auntie oh, Helen, Auntie heart Helen. so cold, Sorry. Uncle Roger don't even need fridge in house. Her heart so cold, you put leftover on her chest, it stay fresh forever. But Uncle Roger don't know how to prepare for date anymore. Been too long. What do people do for date now? Hopefully, Uncle Roger still have sex appeal. I want to be uncle on street, but hot young nephew in the sheets. Mm. Uncle Roger also bought bow tie. Hopefully, Auntie Jenny impressed. Uncle Roger don't know how to wear this. Hiya! Too long, never use bow tie. Okay, uh, okay. If you're wearing a bow tie when you're like bow tie, 20 so something years old or above, sure must impress I don't know what to say. <laughs> Must not forget to comb my hair also. How I look, how I look, so trendy, so fashion. Okay, Uncle Roger ready to go on Zoom date now. But I love first, how he Uncle Roger need to put my leg down from chair. Not because Uncle Roger upset, it's because more polite like. A few moments later. Oh my god, you so pity, you even pitier over Zoom. Oh my goodness, you not too bad yourself. I bought new bow tie just for you. What you think? Looks so nice, Uncle Roger. A little bit, uh, a little bit crooked. Oh, a little bit crooked. Oh, okay, okay. Uncle Roger not used to wearing bow tie. So, so fancy, so fancy. And DJ like. Uncle Roger haven't been on date in five years. <laughs> So nervous. Uncle Roger haven't been no, on date in no, five so years. So lonely, always alone. Wow. Very sad. Uncle Roger, same. Really? But Auntie Auntie Jenny <laughs> yes. so pity. How come no man come after you? Auntie Jenny is picky. Need to find the right match. Not a lot of guys who like the Tai Chi. Like to go to the market and slap the watermelon. Hi ya. Uh, good match old is lady, hard to find. Old Chinese no, lady for things, this right? date. Uncle Roger prepared a meal for myself and I made egg fried rice. I got recipe from BBC Food. Ha ha ha, just good kidding, one, just kidding. One. Wow, and one and a half stars. The egg fried rice. Oh my god, your egg fried rice looks so nice. Thank you. Uncle, Uncle Roger, Roger approved. Approved. Oh, oh. Oh, 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 we got so much chemistry already. Oh my god. Uh, Uncle Roger, I'm feeling the love. Uncle Roger put my leg down from chair, but now my third leg is standing up. <laughs> okay. Sorry, sorry. Sometimes Uncle Roger like dirty jokes. And DJ love a good dirty joke. Oh, what's your favorite dirty joke? And DJ, there you go. Come back later. I tell you on second date. Can't give it all away, okay? Right, so, Auntie Jenny, where are you from? Auntie Jenny, from LA. LA? <laughs> LA so far from Uncle Roger. Uncle Roger live in London. Hiya. How, how, how Tinder going to do us like that, okay? Finally find the perfect match and you're 6,000 miles away. Tinder playing with Uncle Roger feeling. One day, maybe we can meet. Maybe Uncle Roger can buy a pigeon. Send Auntie Jenny a letter. So, Uncle Roger, yes. did you make your own fried rice? Yes, Uncle Roger know how to make egg fried rice since I was three years old. This is Uncle Roger, best dish ever. Because Uncle Roger, when I was younger, I worked in Chinese takeaway and I was child labor. <laughs> Let me show you Uncle Roger's favorite possession. Uncle Roger don't have many valuable things in life. Uncle Roger, no kid, no wife, no pet, no dog. But the most valuable thing to me is my rice cooker. Yo, that's true though for mm. Oh sorry, for an don't Asian this person. Rice cooker, kind of rice cooker. Uncle Roger so has this handy. rice cooker 10 years now. Lasted longer than my marriage. But this rice cooker is an Uncle Roger kit. I bring it to school. Sometimes I sleep next to it. Sometimes I take bath with it and then accidentally electrocute myself. But it's worth it. It's the sacrifice parents make for children. 
Don't worry, I will never cheat on you unless it's with my rice cooker. <laughs> do you have rice cooker, Auntie Jenny? Auntie Jenny do not have rice cooker. Auntie Jenny had to decide between rice cooker and my most prized possession. <gasps> It's a Kara OK mic. Oh my <laughs> okay. god, that is beautiful. Because Sorry. Uncle Roger have the exact same mic. Stupid. Ayah, you have the same one? It's like the world want us to be together. <laughs> Auntie Jenny, let's do karaoke together. Look at this, let's turn on the mic. The Bluetooth device is connected successfully. This mic sounds so cute, sounds just like Uncle Even the Roger. mic has a My British My favorite singer is Cantonese voice. singer, uh -huh. Jackie Chung. When Uncle Roger younger, many people say I look like Jackie. But then Uncle Roger always say Uncle Roger better looking. Let me show you a, a few songs. Five hours later <sighs> I think we got along so well When can I see you in real life? So we go karaoke together I can bring you to the park Eat some rice, feed some duck We have nice life together Uncle Roger, feeding duck sounds so nice I also really like to eat ducks No, no, we, we feed the duck We don't <laughs> eat the duck we feed oh. this, is, this duck oh. belongs to the park Cannot eat no, no. Okay. Duck you see hanging from Chinese restaurant. That's not duck from park. That's <laughs> duck from market. Different duck. In the UK, if you eat duck from park, you get fined. It's illegal. <laughs> Uncle Roger got duck secret. Uncle Roger not allowed. You haven't tried roast duck. Because last time you're missing Uncle out. Roger I know it's not. To US, I was it may sound kind of weird, but Uncle Roger tried give it a try. The skin is crispy. Into LAX. Uncle Roger, got a fat. Criminal. No, no, got no. Meat. Not criminal. Criminal. <laughs> smuggle hits the spot heroin sometimes. and cocaine. Uncle Roger just smuggle oh. crispy pork because I miss <gasps> crispy pork. pork. So but the good. customs officer, they don't like crispy pork. They are all vegan. <laughs> if Auntie Jenny and Uncle Roger, if we have children, if they are vegan, we don't want them. We <laughs> throw them away. We give them all to no. a Buddhist temple. So Uncle Roger cannot go to the US because deported by vegan people. <laughs> what if, what if Auntie Jenny come to UK, come to UK London, come visit Uncle Roger here? What you think? Can you do that? Auntie Jenny will do anything to see Uncle Roger. I will go to UK. I hope I get to see Auntie Jenny on mm. the second day. Little does she think we know she's Roger already in the UK. Day. Bye! <sighs> that was such a nice date. Uncle Roger not have so much fun in a long time. Auntie Jenny is my true soulmate. Maybe Uncle Roger can now move on from my ex-wife. <laughs> <sighs> oh, is who calling, calling me at this Auntie hour? Helen? Must be my best friend Tony. <laughs> Was that the next episode? Oh my gosh, what a heck of, what a anticipated episode. We finally see that Uncle Nigel, Uncle Roger, finally met the woman of his dreams. They seem to have good chemistry, uh, having a Zoom date with Auntie Jenny, right, I believe. I got confused before. I thought Auntie Jenny was Auntie Helen, his ex-wife. I don't know why I got confused, but they're completely different people. Now I can see that they had a lot of fun uh, filming this as well. If you watch toward the end of the episode, they have some bloopers. So we see that, you know, Uncle Roger, he hasn't dated for five years. Well, it's been quite a long time. And what really killed me was on date where eating uh, egg fried rice as well, you know, having a Zoom date and eating um, together. And, you know, unfortunately, Auntie Jenny uh, lives in LA, so that's quite a far distance from the UK. But, you know, since the Zoom date went well, you know, hopefully Auntie Jenny can come visit to the UK. And I guess Uncle Roger, he can't visit because there's stupid vegans um, deporting him back. Since they don't like roast duck and roast pork, which if you guys haven't tried that, those two dishes are there. Oh, super delicious. And if you're a vegan, I'm sorry. So, <laughs> but, okay. So at the end of this uh, little episode short, we see that Auntie Helen is 
requesting a FaceTime audio with uh, Uncle mm-hmm. Roger. So we'll see, mm-hmm. hopefully, in the next episode or you know later on, who this Auntie Helen is. So thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys in my next video.